What's going on everybody? It's Info Penguin here back with another video today. We're getting started with Act 9 of our minion army build. And one of starting in one of the best maps in the world. Blood Aqua Dog. I may be saying that because it's maybe my favorite, maybe a little uh biased, but you know whatever. We still need to look for a good base of gloves, so uh, I can't remember. I can't forget to keep my eye out for that. Oh, oh Chong, Chong, destroy regalia. Not not good enough for me to want it. Nice, a good one. Picking up some stuff, yeah. I like it. A lot of gem level ups, pretty nice. I need a jade amulet to drop really bad ducks. Maybe you should roll if we find one. I'm frozen, so kinda sad, but it wasn't that bad. Because I was uh, too strong. Essence of doubt, easy. Sage one. Wait, what is that? Oh no, that's the projectile one. Would be good if we're maybe like a kinetic blast or power siphon build, but we're not. So too bad. Could have picked it up and sold it. Hindsight 2020 though, you know. Um, no movement speed, don't want. It's a lot of yes. Or a lot of percent yes. Not good enough. 13 all res? I mean, that's better. I can just add life. If I got, wait, I want to make sure if I get rid of this, I'm not. Hey, I'm screwing myself. Oh, I'm screwing myself over on decks. Oh, I am. How much decks do I have? 15? I only have 13. Ooh. Oof. I don't want to re-roll this because it's such a low... Well, it's 53. What lars do I need? Cold? And it gives everything but cold? <laughs> yeah, whatever. I'm just going to keep looking. Uh, we could also yes. throw away... We'll throw away... We'll throw that away. Max life, dex, and minion accuracy. That's actually a good jewel. We'll keep that. Chaos Res, Mana, no. Chaos Res is really good, but we don't really care about the See. rest of them. So this is actually really strong. So we'll make our next jewel actually this one probably because all the stats are pretty good for us. So what we're going to do now is go straight over here. So this is where it deviates from uh, the previous act where we actually uh, go all the way to the descent. And, uh, yeah. So, this is the act where, uh, the syndicate starts to show up more often. Or just show up at all, I guess. Uh, once we get to the desert, I know they show up for sure. And, uh, we're, I'm gonna be holding A. Maybe I'll put, I'm gonna put, uh, someone race Spectre right there. And I don't care that spell echo is on because as long as I summon one syndicate operative, uh, I can just go to my hideout and make sure I summon both of them. And I'll be happy boy. So that that's our goal for this act is get the syndicate operative and start running with it. It is probably better to have these uh, auto frost golems for longer. So if you're worried about 
um, bricking the build or whatever, uh, yeah, be worried. Just watch me do it. And if I fail, then uh, you know not to do it. That's how we learn science and stuff, man. Pretty strong. I gotta look up the links. I haven't played Cynic Adopters in a bit. I know it's GMP. And then usually we're doing cold conversion, but I'll just do like minion damage and predator or minion speed or something like that. It's too generic damage, because usually you put on like, uh, I don't know if you put on added cold, but I know you put on hyperthermia. And you don't need pierce, which is really good. Because they already have pierce on their projectiles. So it makes them extra, extra good. Kill these purple mobs. Maybe they'll drop stuff. Uh, I don't see any syndicate. Usually there's a syndicate over here somewhere. So what we need to do is find uh, the waypoint, which, speaking of the devil, and then we need to find the, the uh, there's going to be an explanation point somewhere on the map. Right over here. You'll see another one. So the storm weather chest is what we're looking for. If you go all the way top right, you'll see, actually see another explanation point. And that's for the, like, there's like a storm going on in front of a, a thing that you can't pass. And you actually need to complete this first to get there. So I'll show you what I mean. So we have to kill all the minions that keep spawning. It'll drop the storm blade. Um, and then we get the uh, the bottle from someone. So if we go back and we give this to uh, what's their face? The combo people. Uh, we'll get a, uh, we'll do a shield. We can definitely upgrade a shield. Bye. And then uh, you talk to Sin and then you talk to them again. They'll give you this bottled storm. And then you can go back to just where you were, the Steary Desert. And now you head up right and you'll see that wall again. And if you didn't see it in the first place, don't worry about it. Because you can see I haven't seen it. You go up here. The storm will end, but it'll consume the bottle in the storm. And then we're going to go fight Skarner. He's a scorpion. We call him Skarner. If you've ever played League of Legends, you know what I'm talking about. It's weird I haven't seen any of the Syndicate yet. Usually both of these levels would have had Syndicate. So, Forbidden Vault is not where we want to go. Looks like we're going to full clear this area. It's crazy the one time I want to do the Syndicate, um, they're not showing up. Just. My. Luck. Two essences, any fears? Any doubters? Oh shoot, I summoned specters. Because I thought predator support was here. Oh shoot. Alright, well, give me a second. I need to redo my dumbness. Um. There's one. They're pretty bulky, so they're kind of easy to see. There's two. Um, there's three. Got him. Well, since there's no syndicate, I'm going to turn this into predator for the time being, because we're also doing the boss fight, so, you yeah, know. 
Yeah, no. So he's phased, so we can just wait over here. You'll see his tail pop up. Oh, cute little tail, little oh, buddy. And we, we don't sprint along. You kind of have to wait for him to follow you. It's kind of annoying. That's what makes this fight a little annoying. You just have to, like, constantly wait. Nice chance. Can't pick it up for seven. Oh, there we go. I think my minions were blocking me, those jerks. So the thing about this fight is you'll see the quicksand. If you stay in it, you'll get a increasing debuff that makes you just your action speed slower. So it makes your movement speed, your attack speed, your cast speed, your everything is gonna be a ton slower. So try to stay out of the actual quicksand. Swallowing sands. All right, try to. He's gonna do a lot of phases, so uh, he's in. A, this is an annoying fight. We won't kill him instantly. He's gonna jump around and stuff. Thinks he's all cool. He thinks he's a dolphin. Silly, silly boy. You're you're a scorpion, dude. Shamu, Shamu's got more skills than you. I'm sorry, dude. Where'd he go? Is he still jumping? There he is. Still jumping. There we go, finally. So now we can go back. We can turn in the quest, get our skill point. And then go back to Vesteri Desert. I'm actually going to reset the instance and hopefully we get the syndicate. Uh, I, I think it usually says if there's an immortal syndicate in this. That says something about uh, defeating the immortal syndicate. Maybe this is because this is my second character and I've already done the immortal syndicate. It doesn't want me to do it again. I don't know. I'm just trying to make up reasons that don't make me go crazy. I want me some mortal syndicates. So you're going to go up, hug the right side to find a waypoint. And this area forks as well. Yeah, we already got that last point. So we're going to grab this waypoint and we're going to actually go into this door over here. It is a dead end, so we're going to do this one first. You're going to kill a kill something and get another skill point. Pretty simple. We'll do the shrine. That's XP. What? No. That's so dumb. Let's let's just uh let's not talk about that. <laughs> uh Birthday RNG, I swear. Not streamer RNG. It's not streamer pr privilege. Don't get mad at me. <laughs> I'm not even streaming, so. So the trick is when they're when he's channeling, when he does that little channel thing where he sticks up his tail, uh, just make your character look away from him, because he'll turn you to stone if you stare at him. Oh, uh, who do we turn into? Oh no, we don't turn in. We just get the Pasilis Acid. And we turn it into Sin later on. Ah. Anyways, you can do a side quest over here. It's really easy. Um, you just have to kill Boulderback. He's, you know, these like uh, horse cow bull guys right over here. Whatever you want to call them. One of them bigger. One of them's unique. You kill him. His name's Boulderback. And I think you get a regret point, if I do remember correctly. So if you're looking for those tasty regret points, which I'm going to actually need a few of them, so I'm going to try to find them. He's usually on the sides over here. He's just slightly bigger than the other ones.
grab this regret because we will need those. Apparently I'm not going to find them today. It usually shows up in your... Yep, see it says kill builder boulder back. He's one of these guys. See this one right here that's going to die in half a second. So I think that's a regret point. I could be wrong. But we're just going to go upwards as much as we can. And uh, then uh, find a dead end. So well, you, ha you have to first find a dead end. Then once you find the dead end, you go the correct way, which is actually to the right for now. Nope. It's actually to the left. I'm... I am lying. You go up, up, down, down. I'm teaching you the Konami cut. It's over here, correct? Yeah, yeah. Yas. It is. There we go. Tunnel. So there's a lab in there. So keep your eye out for it. This is the one I usually miss if I'm like running through my first time. Always the tunnel. So let us not miss it this time. I feel like it was left, but I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna continue this way. Might have been left over there. On the waypoint, that's a good sign. Oh, that's a bad sign. I think I passed it. I think the <laughs> the trial was down there. Might might be able to get to it from here though. If I keep going down. Nope. Dash. I'm not gonna backtrack until I like find the exit. Yeah, we'll see. Get the shrine, pretty good. Um, we're not gonna do that. Keep on a going. So we didn't find the, the trial here. There is a trial in the tunnels. If you found it, good job. If you didn't, uh, you're gonna have to go back if you need it. it sucks for you. Uh, I'm gonna actually. I'll grab this and then do the deli mirror. So if you talk to Sin, he's gonna uh, say, "Yo, I need the powder." Which we're gonna do in uh, one of the near areas. So this area, forks, there's two exits here. The actual like the way to continue is you talk to Sin, and he opens up that little butthole. But you need to get stuff before he opens the butthole for you. You are not welcome into the butthole until you give it powder. Which sounds worse somehow. It's like he needs ointment for his butthole. Um, I'm gonna work on getting this to three. I wanna, I wanna get a cluster jewel. If I get a medium, min, minion, <laughs> minion, minion, this is a minion bill. That's the name of it now, minion. Or should I be super? Right, when I make a build guide for this, should I be super cringe and like make it all like uh, minions, like. Uh, <laughs> like, you know, the minions from uh, Despicable Me. <laughs> dude, I'm going to get... Dude, I'll, I'll post, it, uh, post a video on Facebook. I'll get so many views on Facebook if I post a minions thing. Like, Despicable Me minions. As the thumbnail. Holy cow. Am I genius? Wait, did I just stumble, accidentally stumble into absolute gold? So you see, I found both exits just circling the whole thing because I was trying to uh, juice out all the stuff and not really get too rewarded from it, unfortunately. But um, you see, we saw the refinery and then we found the uh, the other thing, which we're going to go to after. You need to do both of them. So it doesn't matter re really which one you do first. Whichever one you find first, you go do. That's a uh, not piece of advice. Okay, here's the syndicate. I need to. We'll need more than to beat us, Bruce. My 
Enforcer. Vanguard worker. I don't see operative. Darn it. Didn't see any. Maybe. This will make the bad port so it needs to say syndicate operative. I never rolled this bow. Plus one to cold. Five block. That's almost good. I don't think we don't want plus one cold on this build, unfortunately. I probably could have saved that shield and maybe sold it. I mean, if it was like day one, definitely would have been able to sell it. So that was the only syndicate thing <laughs> in this map, unfortunately, because they only do one. So there we go. So didn't get my operatives. I might go and grind to get my operatives. I just realized I only have two specters. Um, wait, Syndicate Marksman. Wait, can I spawn the Syndicate operatives if they died here? Marksman? I don't think any operatives spawn, unfortunately. It's only with uh, interceptions, I think. But I'm not seeing any of my uh, golem boys. Oh, there we go. Frost auto. Oh, shoot. Wrong button. Frost auto. There we go. Got our third one. Darn, I was hoping to get Seneca operative. So it has to be in, is it an intervention they only spawn from? They only spawn from certain things. Quicksilver actually really good. Hmm. Don't touch the, the electric that he's gonna spawn. Like, <laughs> after he dies, but. He's gonna spawn electricity and you dodge it. So we got the powder. We got the powder for the butthole, so now we can go into the butthole. But first, we're gonna do a different thing. We're gonna go. Um, I'm gonna reset. Will Syndicate boys spawn, please? No. Whatever. But I'm gonna go right because it's probably gonna be to the right. Sometimes it's to the left. Maybe I shouldn't have reset the instance. But I did want to kill more stuff, so like. We already went to the refinery, so bad decision. So it's either gonna be up or to the left. So speed wise, I made the biggest mistake, but uh, just chilling wise, no one cares. All right, let's kill the So it's probably over here to the left. So I'm gonna make sure I hug the walls and make sure I get like close enough so a, a, an arrow would spawn. There we go. So we're gonna kill the boss here. It's a lot of travel modes. So this is going to be multi-phase, so it's going to spawn a bunch of tornadoes and spawn a bunch of enemies. And then we're going to have to kill them all, and then she's going to go invisible and chase us down. Right there. We're going to phase her again. She's going to spawn a bunch of minions again after she tries to kill us again. There we go. Now she's going to spawn a bunch of minions. Now she's going to try to gank us again so just stay out of the tornado she'll follow you you don't have to stay in the tornado to attack her so don't really worry now you can head back you can turn in your uh, your stuff you can vendor you can do what you need so we got that regret from the, the thing what does this give us nothing we want so we're gonna vendor Mm, bad. Vendor this. 
Take care. I need to put this away so you guys don't get mad at me and stare at it. So we got these going. Um, I don't really want that anymore. I want to reset Mystery Desert and do Syndicate stuff. Like, why aren't, why aren't they spawning? There's usually a defense thing that spawns here. I'm just getting really unlucky apparently. There one that spawns here. No. All right, we're just gonna continue to do the quarry. Um, I did want to get syndicate operatives naturally to show off to you guys. It doesn't look like that's gonna happen, unfortunately. I'm just gonna top off my life. One, two, and three. So we just kind of follow the path that we go here and then we're going to do uh, go through some portals, kill some mini bosses and then kill the final boss of the act. So there aren't any, I don't think there's any more portals. So that was your last time to go back to town. Uh, I mean, you can portal back at any time, but make sure your gear is up to par of where you want it to be for the final act boss. It's a similar fight to Brian King where he's going to shrink the arena and kind of stand on top of us doing attacks and we're just not to dodge stuff that's the the idea of the fight it's pretty easy we'll just kind of uh big damage him oh we don't have to kill that guy but he looked at me funny so so it looks like i went the wrong way so we go back the other way All right, getting frozen. Cool, cool beans. But I didn't get a freeze immune. Fly. I mean, I do have a bleed immune, so that's pretty good. But no freeze immune is pretty sad. Uh, this looks like the wrong way, but we're gonna go. Whoa, essence, essence of a. Uh, whoa, dude. Which? Okay, do I go this way? I'm confused about. Where I should be going. I think this is the right way. It's gonna go dead end as soon as I say that. Oop. Dead end over there. Ooh, alteration. Me likey. Alterations are really good. How much are they worth right now? Because they like generally they rise in price as the league goes on. Because they have so many uses. It's it's like a currency item. So like you can it's like technically money, but like it's one of the most useful currency items in my opinion. Alright, so we found the little bee hole. So now we're gonna enter three we're gonna talk this in first, and then we're gonna enter three portals and we're gonna have to kill the mini boss in each portal. Um where should I go? Hmm. I need to think about it. I don't have my uh, POB up right now, so I need to see if I missed anything. We don't have many defensive layers, unfortunately, with this build. Like, a lot of builds have, like, a lot of evasion or dodge or armor. 
mind over matter. We don't really have any of that stuff, so we're just like pure bulkiness. We're gonna stand behind these pillars. Hopefully our minions don't kill it. We took two, three pulses, so we're fine. So you need to stand behind those pillars when Dodri is doing his screaming. So uh, if you're playing a build that automatically kills things, that sucks. Try to plan to not die. Maybe use a portal. I don't know. There's some options to get around it. You just place your minions correctly, and I only had my carrying golem attacking, so it didn't do enough damage to kill the portal. I got kind of lucky. A lot of spiders, holy cow. Freaking think that our collie's in here. Look at all these spiders. I've never seen so many spiders in a zone. What is this? Uh, Ash? An Ash, uh, whatever? I think it's Ash. Divine Mana Fly is actually really good. Divine are actually somewhat better than Eternal uh, Mana Flask, which is like weird to say, but it is. So he's going to phase and uh, clone himself into multiple people over here. So, just kill all of them. Well, the last one's going to be real, of course, and then they're, he's going to die. So, not too, e not, not, not too hard. Shav, probably the easiest one. Boop, 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 boop. But yeah, we're really close to the end. So once we get all three of these portals, uh, Sin will open up the middle thing, and then that's going to be the final fight. Cool, I'll jewel up. It goes up. And they get the shav. Free kill. When she comes back, free kill, I mean. I forgot she phased. There we go. There we go. Easy. Go back to Black Core. Now you talk to Sin. He's going to open up the little... Look at it. Watch it. So gross. Alright. Now we go here. Now we're going to kill the dude. So once you get him to a third HP, he's going to run away like a little pansy. Stay away from the things on the ground. He puts a lot of stuff on the ground. Anything red or purple or green, you just stay away from. So he's pretty much the combination of those three, uh, three bosses. So that's the idea behind it. With little spider scorpions, and he dead. He a dead boy. So now you have to avoid the. Oh my god! Gotcha. Ooh, we can make an animate guardian with that. Ooh. Now I talked to Lily, say hello to Oreth, and we're going to be getting with the final act in the next episode. Make sure you guys check that out. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys on the next video. Later.